At a news conference this morning, NCD Governor Powers Pakop expressed deepest condolence on behalf of the city and urged all to stand up and pay respect for the member of Mosby Northwest and the former Prime Minister. First, I would like to, on behalf of the city, you know, again express our deepest condolence to the family of our late uh, Semikara Morauta, Lady Rosalind Morauta, uh, James and all the other siblings, and all the supporters in Northwest, and his relatives from uh, Kukipi Village, uh, Gulf Province, friends and everyone, for the passing away of the late Semikara Morauta. He says this is a time our city, our people, and our country should stand together during the loss of a great leader. Member for Mosby South, Justin Tachenko is the chairman of the organizing committee for late Sir Mekere Morauta's funeral. The minister explains there will be eight days of public mourning for the nation from January 1st to January 8th, 2021. Day one is this Thursday at 1.30 p.m. where the casket and the family will arrive and the body of late, uh, late Sir Mekere Morata will arrive at the VIP uh, car park at the Jacksons International Airport where selected uh, family members and uh, VIPs and uh, members of parliament and the Prime Minister of our country, Honourable James Marape, will receive the body. Late Semekara Morauta will be laid to rest at the Independence Hill on Friday 8th of January 2021. Meanwhile, the body of the former Prime Minister is expected to arrive in the country tomorrow after lunch from Brisbane. Our Prime Minister has requested that he would like to be there with the Governor of the city uh, and the Foreign Affairs Minister to receive the body of late Sir Makeri Moralta, and that's what's happening at 1.30 tomorrow. All those that would like to witness that ceremony will be live streamed on TV uh, through MBC and MTV and others. Uh, and TV One. Gertrude Gabi, National MTV News.